Welcome to this edition of Ethical Sustainable Investment News and Analysis to Profit By. I'm Ron Robbins, an ethical investing pioneer for over 40 years, quoted in the Wall Street Journal, Market Watch, The Globe and Mail, and numerous other media, and founder of the highly respected global ethical sustainable investing information website, Investing for the Soul. And please listen to my disclosure, disclaimer statement at the end of this podcast. Now enjoy this podcast. Hello, Ron Robbins here. Welcome to podcast episode 53, published on March 12th, titled New ESG S&P Indexes, Top Tech Stocks and presented by Investing for the Soul. Investingforthesoul.com is your site for vital global ethical and sustainable investing news, commentary, information, and resources. Remember that you can find a full transcript, links to content including stock symbols, quotes, and bonus material at this episode's podcast page located at investingforthesoul.com forward slash podcasts and Google any terms that are unfamiliar to you. Appearing on Fool.com, Danny Wiener wrote an interesting article titled Three Top Tech Stocks That Will Make You Richer in March and Beyond. I think these would likely fit in any ethical and sustainable portfolio. I'll mention the three stocks, followed by some brief comments from Mr. Wiener. 1. Twilio Many consumers have used Twilio's tools without even realizing it. The real-time messages you get from your food delivery service, the updates from your rideshare provider, the ability to reset a password within an app, How about an in-app chats with customer service? If you have experienced any of those, there's a pretty good chance it was underpinned by Twilio's technology. Two is Etsy. While e-commerce platforms Amazon and Shopify stole the headlines last year, they were both outdone by the little engine that could, Etsy. The tailwinds that propelled digital retail also extended to retro and vintage goods, as well as handmade products. Those trends all played right into Etsy's wheelhouse. The company turned these once niche markets into a lucrative enterprise. 3. Pin Interest It seems like it's only a matter of time before antitrust and regulatory concerns catch up with Facebook. Investors looking for exposure to social media growth without all the drama are turning to pin interest. The platform acts as a digital repository and visual discovery engine that allows users to find, save and organize all their favorite things from around the internet, end quotes. Now this could be something that many ethical and sustainable investors might like. The details are in an article, two new ESG ETFs bring small and mid cap stocks into focus. It's by Jeff Benjamin and was on investmentnews.com. Mr. Benjamin writes that X-Tracker's S&P Mid-Cap 400 ESG ETF and X-Tracker's S&P Small Cap 600 ESG ETF listed Wednesday applying sustainable investing screens to the popular indexes. These are the first ETFs to track the environmental, social and governance versions of the indexes. The new listings follow the X-Trackers S&P 500 ESG ETF, which launched in June 
2019 and has since grown to nearly $450 million. That fund gained 19.9% in 2020 and is up 3.4% this year through February 23rd, which compares to the S&P 500 index, which gained 16.3% last year and is up 3.3% so far this year. End quotes. So here we go again with another analysis of the renewable energy sector titled 15 Biggest Renewable Energy Companies and Stocks. It's by Tai Hucky and was found on Yahoo Finance. I'll list each company followed by some remarks on that company by Mr. Hucky. We start going backward. 15. Krupp Energies AG. Krupp Energies is the leading European producer of ethanol. Ethanol, while not as clean a resource as wind or solar, is still a viable source of renewable energy. The company produces biofuels from renewable raw materials such as sugar syrups, wheat and raw alcohol from wheat, maize and barley. 14. Sun Power Corporation The Silicon Valley-based energy company Sun Power Corp is partially owned by the French multinational oil and gas company Total SE. Sun Power develops and manufactures solar panels and photovoltaic cells. The company has received more than 1,000 patents for solar innovation. 13. Now I hope I can spell, uh, spell this out correctly. Centre Electricus Brasilius SA Preference Shares Series B. Headquartered in Rio de Janeiro, this Brazilian power company is among the top global clean energy companies in the world. More than 90% of Electrobras installed capacity comes from sources with low greenhouse gas emissions. 12. Renewable Energy Group, Inc. This US-based company has been providing cleaner fuels, including biodiesel, renewable diesel, as well as a mixture of the two known as REG, R-E-G, Ultra Clean. The company operates 12 biorefineries dispersed across America, as well as in Europe. 11. Han Energy Holding Group, private. It is China's largest privately held energy enterprise operating on projects of hydro, wind and solar power. It is known for being the leader in thin film solar technology. 10. Brookfield Renewable Partners LP Known as one of the world's largest investors in renewable power, this Canadian company operates in the wind, solar and hydropower sectors of the renewable energy industry. Brookfield Renewable Partners' parent company, Brookfield Asset Management, is ranked at 155 on Fortune's Global 500 ranking. 9. First Solar Inc. First Solar is an American company established in 2001, most recognized for selling photovoltaic systems and photovoltaic modules. First Solar has also recently pledged to power 100% of its global solar PV manufacturing operations with renewable energy by year 2028. 8. Canadian Solar Inc. is a solar photovoltaic module manufacturer. The company has subsidiaries in 20 countries, while their products are brought by customers hailing from more than 150 countries. 7. Jinko Solar Holding Company Limited Jinko Solar currently stands as the top solar panel manufacturer in the world by market share, 
distributing solar products to many countries. 6. Next Era Energy Inc. A subsidiary of the Fortune 500 company Next Era Energy. Next Era Energy Resources is the world's largest generator of wind and solar renewable energy. They also offer energy storage and energy marketing, among other services. 5. Orsted A slash S. The company has been ranked as the top most sustainable energy company in the world by Corporate Knights Global 100 Index for three consecutive years. The multinational company is also the largest energy company in Denmark, providing wind, power, bioenergy, thermal power, and customer solutions and distributions. 4. Siemens Gamasa Renewable Energy SA The company was formed as a result of the merger between Siemens Wind Power and Gamasa. Siemens Gamasa is a Spanish-German wind engineering company. The Sustainability Yearbook, compiled annually by SMB Global Inc., has named this company several times over the years, recognizing efforts made to promote and achieve sustainability. 3. Vestas Wind Systems A slash S. Vestas Wind Systems stands as the largest installer of wind turbines in the world. Vestas Wind Systems also provides a digital platform known as Vestas Online for wind turbine owners to manage their wind turbine related self services including invoices, blade asset management and service order reports. 2. Tesla Inc. Elon Musk's electric car company is also a big leader in the renewable energy industry. The company also sells energy storage, solar roof tiles and solar panels. Its subsidiary, Solar City Corporation, also known as Tesla Sona, manufactures these products and is known to be a low cost provider of solar products. 1. Ibudrola SA Topping our list of 15 biggest renewable energy companies and stocks is none other than the Spanish multinational energy giant Ibudrola. Beginning as Hartford City Light Company in USA over 170 years ago, Ibudrola has grown to be the number one producer of wind power in the world. End quotes. Now this one will be fascinating to watch. The details are in this press release. Humankind Investments launches first sustainable ETF. Here are some quotes. Humankind Investments, a quantitatively driven asset manager specializing in socially responsible investments, announced today the launch of its first exchange-traded fund, the Humankind U.S. Stock ETF. Humankind is exclusively focused on socially responsible investing, said Katz. This commitment is reflected in the corporate DNA of the Humankind U.S. Stock ETF. To our knowledge, it's the first registered investment company organized as a benefit corporation. The Humankind U.S. Stock ETF leverages the firm's proprietary Humankind U.S. Equity Index to track the top 1,000 U.S. companies that promote healthier, safer, more equitable and longer lives. The index's ranking is based on a quantitative analysis of each company's positive and negative contributions to society as measured by its impact on investors, consumers, employees and citizens, 
defined as its humankind value. End quotes. Now many of you are interested in dividends from ESG and sustainable stocks and funds. Well, go to this article and if you feel comfortable, sign up for their free registration to get all their recommendations. Please note, however, I have no idea about who is behind this site and what they may or may not do with your email address, though. The article is titled Top 25 Socially Responsible Dividend Stocks Income to Feel Good About and appeared on etfchannel.com. Here are four that they give away freely. Marathon Petroleum Corp with a 4.11% yield. International Business Machines Corp with a 5.43% yield. Gilead Sciences Inc. with a 4.49% yield. And Texas Instruments with a 2.5% yield. Well, these are my top news stories with their stock and fund tips for this podcast. New ESG S&P indexes, top tech stocks. To get all the links, stock symbols, or to read the transcript of this podcast and more, go to investingforthesoul.com forward slash podcasts and scroll down to this episode. Also, be sure to click the like and subscribe buttons in iTunes, Apple Podcasts, or wherever you download or listen to this podcast. And please click the share buttons to share this podcast with your friends and family. Let's promote a better post-COVID world through ethical and sustainable investing. Contact me if you have any questions. Stay well and healthy and conscious about the ethical and sustainable values of your investments. Thank you for listening. Talk to you next on March 26th. Bye for now. Learn how to create a simple portfolio reflecting your personal values by taking my one-hour tutorial. Go to investingforthesoul.com forward slash podcasts and click the link in the right-hand column for my DIY Ethical Sustainable Investing Pays tutorial. Now, I'll mention in the podcast if I have any direct interest or holdings in companies or securities I'm talking about. Furthermore, any news, opinions, analysis, or other information offered by myself, as well as references and information to or from other external sources in this podcast is provided as general market information and should not be relied upon and thus does not constitute investment advice. Investors should consult their own licensed investment professional before making investments. Also, I will not accept liability for any loss or damage, including without limitation any loss of profit which may arise directly or indirectly from use of or reliance on information in this podcast. Do contact me at ron r at investingforthesoul.com. Signing off, this is Ron Robbins.